Welcome back to YouTube to Rick's YouTube channel and finally I have installed Flight Simulator 2020. It's taken me three days. Uh, there were some problems with the Microsoft Store when I initially downloaded uh, the, for the first time. It downloaded up to about 85 gig and then just completely froze. Found out Microsoft Store were having some server issues so I had to wait until the servers went back online, tried to download it again. It wouldn't download. Uh, I didn't have enough space on my hard drive so it had installed 90 gig of uh, data from Flight Simulator to my hard drive, but it was saying it couldn't install the rest because there was not enough space on my hard drive. So I had to delete all the files and restart the uh, download again, which took over 14 hours to download 120, 20 something gig. It's finally done, done it last night. Uh, I've not opened it up yet. So uh, I'm gonna, Press play, see what it's like. I've just updated my graphics card as well, the drivers on that, uh, GeForce. So I'm gonna press play and see what happens. Now, a couple of you have requested for me to uh, start this up for the first time and uh, upload the video just to see if I've got any problems. So yeah, I haven't been on this for absolute months. It must have been well over probably just under a year so let's see what's going to happen to try and get the uh Yeah, I've just turned the display capture off and ooh. Bit jittery there. So far so good. PC's pretty quiet. Although it does need a good clean. I've not touched this for ages, the PC. I have taken out a couple of things on it and not inserted some of the bits at the back, so dust is probably built up so I'm gonna to have to sort that out and it's not an incredibly uh, fast PC it was a couple of years back but since I've removed some of the memory still running uh, Ryzen 7 I think it's a 2700x uh, it's got 16 gig of Corsair Vengeance memory. I have put another 16 gig in another PC that I've got, so uh, it was 32 gig. And also I've swapped the graphics card. Uh, it's just running uh, a Zeus uh, six gigabyte graphics card. So yeah, it's pretty, it's still fast, but not as uh, fast as I would like it. Yeah, so, so far so good it's not crashed let's have a look uh where do i want to go i want to go to my hangar if I go to his profile make sure all my stuff is there well i can't remember flying that graphics are not looking particularly that brilliant well how, how do i see the actual, no. Right, I'm in my hangar. Where do I go to my hangar? Well, I've only got one plane. So that just sets view. That's in the aircraft. Hmm. Home. How do I go to my... Right, we're in profile. So it's logbook. Right. Right. 
I swear I've had more that you get more planes than this. Why can't I? Oh, well, we go to content manager then. There's a lot that's not installed. So that's all my planes yet. Yeah. So I'm going to have to install a hell of a lot more. I just can't find a way of getting to have a look at all the planes in my hangar. Is that just the default plane that pops up? Right, anyway, I guess we'll just fly this. So I'm in the UK. I have got the, uh, is it the Urbex? Uh, London City Airport, I remember buying that. Where are we? It's over here. Let's, uh, we'll take off from here. Right, now many of you wanted to see this video, whether to see this is going to uh, crash the desktop. Hopefully, it's not gonna do that. I can't see the blue line on my screen, but I can see it on OBS. Wow, so what has just happened? For some reason, it's picking all that up. Everything. Oh. Wow, it does look pretty, uh, pretty pants. Let's try and. Uh, how do we get the uh, settings up? General options, graphics. What have we got? Let's put the rendering up to halfway. such a long time since I've played this so trying to have the details on high trees low buildings we'll go for high then I'm not really bothered oh, go on then. objects level of detail but let's see it volumetric clouds Text to resolution high. Just left. I don't even know what I'm pressing now. There's just water waves, medium. I am just literally turning everything on. This has changed so much. I think that's it. Do I have to press save or just jump back into the game? VR, PC. Custom, oh, medium, ultra. Let's go, just go high end. I should have pressed that from the start. Apply and save. I guess this is where the, the PC is gonna heat up. Uh, it's not looking too bad. I'm using an Xbox controller. Uh, I don't even know how to take off now. I've not played it in absolutely ages. Oh yeah. What, so it's... Let's give this a go.
bring the speed back a bit it's a London no I didn't buy the London I'm not too sure if I bought the London City or, or actually I bought London uh, sorry extension pack there's the XL Arena on the right hand side we're gonna just go out to the OT I'll take if this is a fixed gear look too bad the graphics I don't know what it's looking like for you guys so there's the O2 arena I'm just wondering has it just installed the base settings for the the simulator I'm just going to call it a game I know it's a simulator but do I have to uh, go onto my packages. What? Why does it keep auto throttling up? Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to uh, re-download that. Anyway, I'm going to turn around. Uh, we're going to land back at London City. See if I can put this uh, plane back on the ground without crashing. What a place to live on the approach to London City. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to go through all the settings because I don't like the uh, the landing, the the glide hints. And definitely mess around with the graphics yeah but let me know you what you uh, what you think I'll go into more detail about the PC and let you know all the, the specs and then we'll go into all the settings and try and get the best out of this PC with this game I might be coming in a bit too fast flaps all the way down I've actually come on we're running out of runway soon but we're actually super slow not the best of landings We got reverse thrust. <laughs> so we're going to come to a nice halt just before the piano keys. Not a problem. Let's just get this onto the taxiway. Yeah, it definitely doesn't uh, look too healthy the taxiway over there. It's currently in the water. But anyway, I'm going to apply the brake. Is that the brake? Ooh. We're just washing the wheels. That's all we're doing. Right. We are down on the ground. Uh, definitely some flood in there. As you can see, let's have a quick look around at the skyline. Not the best. Uh, let me know what you think. Let me know what settings I should apply. Yeah, so that's the first video. Uh, not been too bad. I need to go into uh, my hangar, sort out all my planes, obviously do the graphics and all the other settings. So yeah, if you uh, know your way around Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020, be sure to comment and make sure you uh, subscribe because I'll be doing a lot more of these videos, getting back into the game and exploring the world. 
so uh, no crash to desktop just yet uh, which I'm pretty happy about uh, let's play a few more games I'll make a few more videos and uh, start pushing this PC and see what it can do anyway hit the like button subscribe and I'll get back to you with another video thanks for watching